some of you guys are messing around with um, trying to get analog to digital conversion using one of these uh, microcontrollers. And today I programmed this one to um, take the uh, voltage reading off of a, this is a GameCube stick, this is what's the, uh, the C stick. And right now I only have one of the X sticks hooked up, the other one's not connected to anything. And what it did is uh, one side's connected directly to the uh, positive input here, the power supply. The other one's connected directly to ground. And these eight LEDs here are going to show the uh, like the value um, voltage reading from the uh, potentiometer. I was actually going to use this little red bar graph display here, but Mr. Axel here chewed up the pins so they're all bent and a few of them broken. So I'm not going to be able to use that freaking bird. Anyway, so I got this uh, multimeter here. This one's going to show us the uh, voltage reading from the potentiometer. That's going into the uh, microcontroller. I have it hooked up to 5 volts right here on my little power supply thing. Um, this here is just a resistor network going into these LEDs. Um, these white LEDs are really bright, so I'm going to have to put like this little piece of paper over them so that it doesn't blind everything. This is the eighth LED up here, which would be like the most significant bit in the uh, register. But um, I set it aside because when the when the control stick is um, is in the up direction here, past the middle, it'll turn on, indicating that you know it's going up. If um, once I start pulling it down, it's going to turn off, meaning that it's uh, going down. So I'm going to turn it on here, and I'll show you guys working. See, right now it's in the middle, and some of the like the LED, the white LEDs are on. This one's just sort of like it's really dim, the orange one. And once I put it down, once I put the well, let me move it here closer so you can see it. Once I push a little bit down on the control stick, you can see it turn off because the value becomes a little lower than needed to be able to light that one up. So if I start pulling down on it, you see them go down to, to zero, to a value of zero. If I push up on it, you're going to see the orange LED light up brighter, and then the white LEDs are going to, you're going to see like, like dark spot moving, and that just means like bits see, that are like moving across here and increasing the value. And yes, you can see the orange LED still on. Let it go, and you can see that. Get it closer here. You can see how it affects it. Um, what else can I tell you guys? Oh, I can show you the voltage here. As I push up on this stick here, you're gonna see it increase to five. Well, close enough. Let it go. It's gonna go back down to about two, two, two and a half almost. Bring it down. It should get close to zero. That. So. Now all I gotta do is I gotta take the information that comes out of the analog to digital converter and make it do some stuff so that I can output it and uh, pop it into a or have that data go into the um, the original chip for the 64 controller. So I'm gonna be messing with that now. Now that I got this working, and hopefully I'll have something else to show here soon. So thanks for watching again.